Hi guys, it's Grace with Grace Gets Gastric and I am here today for another meal prep video. So today I'm going to show you how I make this chicken and sweet onion casserole. As always, the original recipe will be linked in the description box down below, but I have made some modifications. Uh, so if you're interested in seeing that, go ahead and keep watching. It is one of my absolute favorite recipes. Uh, there are a little bit of carbs in here because uh, caramelized onions definitely have some carbs, but they are so good and for me personally, one, I'm not keto, so I'm not crazy low carb, but also I uh, am totally, absolutely fine with carbs that come from sources like vegetables, fruits, lactose, etc. So if you are interested in seeing how I make this delicious chicken and sweet onion casserole, go ahead and keep on watching. So I'm going to show you how I make this chicken and sweet onion casserole. So to get started, you're going to want two sweet onions. You'll want half a cup of milk. I'm using non-fat Fairlife milk just because it is lower carb, higher protein. You will want a cup of shredded cheese. I am using a light three cheese blend. You'll want a tablespoon of butter, some salt and pepper. Uh, you'll want a teaspoon, about a teaspoon of fresh thyme. You can also use dried thyme if you do not have fresh. You'll just want to use a little bit less. Uh, I've got 21 ounces of cooked chopped rotisserie chicken breast and then I have a can of cream of celery soup. You could also use a cream of chicken, cream of mushroom. I just happen to have a cream of celery on hand. So the first thing you want to do is take your onions and you want to give them a nice thin slice. So I am of course uh, taking the skins off and then slicing them so you have those nice onion rings. I just think those are, are prettier but you can do it however you'd like. If you prefer a dice or a chop you can also do that as well but um, you wanna make sure you get them more or less even so that they cook kind of at the same uh, rate. And then you'll take that tablespoon of butter and he cook that, heat that up over medium heat in a um, pan. And then you will add in the onions. You can see here, as always, I have chosen a pan that is a little bit too small for my needs, but it will work as of course they are going to reduce down. So this is going to take some time and you want to make sure you get them a nice caramelization so until the onions are really brown. So really make sure that you give it the time to, um, to get there, uh, kind of low and slow. So then I'm going to take my time, speaking of, and uh, I'm going to take that off, you know, de-stem it and give it a little bit of a chop just to make up smaller pieces. And then I am adding that to my 21 ounces of chopped cooked chicken breast. And then I've got my cheese here, uh, the shredded cheese. I've got three-fourths of a cup or three ounces, and um, I'm adding that. And then, of course, the salt and pepper. And then the half a cup of milk and the can of cream of celery soup. So you're just going to take basically all the other ingredients and mix them all together until it becomes one homogenous paste. <laughs> And uh, once you have mixed everything together and it is all kind of even, you will add in those onions that you caramelized earlier. So you add all of the onions and again, give it another stir. So uh, it's, this is a really pretty simple, you know, essentially one bowl recipe. And once it's all together, you're going to take an eight by eight baking dish, coat it with a bit of cooking spray, and then um, put in the, uh, the mixture. So you want to make sure that the mixture is sort of evenly spread throughout the dish uh, so that it cooks well. And uh, then you'll take that uh, one hour, sorry, one ounce of cheese, the remaining fourth cup and top it. And then you will put that in the oven at 350 degrees and bake it for about 20 to 30 minutes until the top looks nice and crispy and golden like you see here. And for me, I uh, divided this into eight servings. Each one is about, I think 5.75 ounces more or less. And again, your mileage may vary depending on how much you can eat, how far out you are. But for me, per serving, it was 185 calories, 22.1 grams of protein, 6.5 grams of fat, 7.8 grams of carbs, and 1.2 grams of fiber. So this is one of my go-to absolute favorite uh, casserole recipes. As you can see, it is really quick and easy to make. Uh, it's really just kind of like a one bowl, you throw it in the oven. The, most time consuming part is really just cooking down the onions, but that is a process that you can, um, you know, get that going and do something else while that, while that happens. Uh, but it's really tasty. Uh, everyone who's tried it has enjoyed it and uh, I hope you guys like it too. Anyways, thank you so much for watching as always and I will talk to you in my next meal prep video.